hello. Today we're going to focus on the letter E. The name of this letter is E. Say the name with me. E. What is the name of this letter? E. The sound of this letter is E. Eh. When you say E, eh, your mouth is open and your tongue is behind your bottom teeth. Say E. Eh. E. Eh. Did your mouth open? Yes, your mouth is open and your tongue is behind your bottom teeth. Say the sound with me. Eh, eh, eh. What is the sound for this letter? Eh. Sometimes going like this helps remind me too. Eh, eh. Good job. Be careful because the sound is similar to the letter A sound, eh, but it's different. Listen carefully. Eh, eh, eh. What is the name of this letter? E, and what's the sound for this letter? Eh, eh, eh. Excellent. In our ABC book, we have E, E, exercise. Eh, eh, eh. Say it with me. E, E, exercise. Eh, eh, eh. Say it loud. E, E, exercise. Eh, eh, eh. Excellent. Make sure you have your index card with the lowercase e because we're going to trace it. And lowercase e is a tricky one. It's one of very few letters that starts in the middle. Isn't that goofy? I thought all the letters started at the top. Well, almost all letters start at the top. Lowercase e starts in the middle. I know. It's a goofy one. So we'll start right here in the middle. You're going to go out, up, and around. Start in the middle. Out around. Can you do it with me? Start right here in the middle. You're going to go straight out, then up and around. Good job. Let's trace it saying the letter in sound. Ready? E, E, exercise. Eh, eh, eh. You do it. Trace that finger. E, E, exercise. Eh, eh, eh. Again. E, E, exercise. Eh, eh, eh. One more time. E, E, exercise. Eh, eh, eh. What letter is this? E, and what sound does it make? Eh, eh, eh. Well, I have a friend here today. Edgar, are you ready? Oh, here comes Edgar. Hi, Edgar, how are you, friends? This is Edgar the elephant, and he came in for E Day. Oh, well, we're so glad you're here, Edgar. Edgar? Hmm, why do you have E's on you? Edgar starts with E. Say it with me, guys. Eh, eh, eh. Elephant does too. Okay, say it with me. Elephant starts with E. Say the sound. Eh, eh, eh. Hmm. Exercise starts with E. Eh, eh, eh. Edgar, do you know what else starts with E? Envelope. Envelope starts with E. Do it with me, friends. Eh, eh, eh. You know what else starts with that letter E? Empty. This envelope I have here, it's empty. Empty starts with E. Eh, eh, eh. Friends at home, if you happen to have an empty envelope around. Grab it. You can hit pause, ask a grown-up. And if you don't have an envelope, you can make one with a blank sheet of paper. Okay? So either grab an envelope or a piece of paper. Hit pause. Get the materials you need. Also grab something fun to do some writing with. Maybe some markers or crayons or something like that. Okay? Perfect. Hit pause until you've got all the materials you need and then come right back. Are you ready, Edgar? Oh, good. Edgar the elephant is ready to start. All right, so I'm going to tip this down so that you can see a little bit better. And I've got my envelope because envelope starts with E. Eh, eh, eh. Good job. It might be a little too low to see. Here we go. And I'm going to practice writing that letter E all over my empty envelope. Are you ready? So you'll grab a color. Okay. And to do my E, I'm going to start in the middle. 
Okay, and I'm gonna go straight out like that. And then I'm gonna go up and around the basin. E. E, E, exercise. Eh, eh, eh. Then I'm gonna do another E again. Start in the middle, go out and around the bases. E, E, exercise. Eh, eh, eh. Now families, if this is tricky, write it in like a yellow highlighter or something like that and have your kiddos trace it, making sure they're forming it correctly because lowercase e is a tricky one. We can do some capital E's too. We can do a big line down, frog jump, get a line across the top, middle, and bottom. And then again, I need to hear you say it, e, e, exercise, eh, eh, eh. Excellent. See how many E's you can put on your empty envelope. Now, if you don't have an envelope, you can make one with a piece of paper. Simply fold it, leaving a little bit of extra on the top so that you can fold it over. And there's your handy dandy envelope. Pretty simple. So I just folded it with a little extra on the top and then went like that. And then you can tape or staple the sides with a grown-up sewing. Okay. And you can write the E's on this as well, okay? And use all sorts of fun colors, switch it up. Ready? All right, you write on your envelope while I write on mine. Okay. And I got to hear you saying it. Here we go. E, E, exercise, eh, eh, eh. You doing it? E, E, exercise, eh, eh, eh. I'm doing capitals and lowercase. Remember, a grown up can help you do those lowercase if you need some help. E, E, exercise, eh, eh, eh. You'll continue on making as many E's as you can on the front and the back of your envelope. Okay, why are we making E's on an envelope? Envelope starts with E. Eh, eh, eh. And it's empty because empty starts with E. Eh, eh, eh. Now here's my bonus for you. When you're done with your envelope, I would love for you to get a blank sheet of paper and draw a picture of something that starts with E. Draw a nice detailed picture and then you can put it in the envelope and then you can give your envelope with your picture to someone special, maybe someone in your family, okay, or a neighbor or a friend. And you can tell them that you learned E, E, exercise, eh, eh, eh. I know who I'm going to give my envelope and picture to. Edgar the Elephant. This is for you. Aw, thanks for the hug. We're glad you joined us today. Friends, what letter are we working on today? E, E, exercise. Eh, eh, eh. Have fun with your envelope and your picture. Bye.